Welcome back to El Cuento, your weekly recap about the ins and outs of the Colegio. My name is Roland Absede, your host and this episode's guide to the stories of days gone by. So what are you waiting for? Let's go! Just last week, the Institute of Communication grabbed yet another trophy for Letran. The national level of the Sining Lekhasan filmmaking competition was where these few talented ARCOM students bagged several awards. John Ren Stabag was awarded first place for his film titled Limos, while Richard Nicolas received third place from his film Guys of Resiliency. The competition was organized by the Earth Day Jam Foundation and Department of Environment and Natural Resources Climate Change Service. The trophy was officially turned over to the Institute of Communication last January 28, 2023. Yan ang tatak, Icom! Wow! So, malitang NCAA naman tayo. Fresh from the highs of the Beach Volleyball Championship, our Letran Squires were off to a great start for the Juniors Basketball Tournament of the NCAA. The Squires outlasted the San Sebastian Staglets 99 to 86 after showing an outstanding back and forth performance. You can watch the Squires live on GTV on the NCAA social media pages on these dates. Nakubo, nangangamay kampiyon na baulet. Galingan yung Squires para magkatarpolin kayo. Gulat kayo no? Kasi ako din eh. Pero balik tayo sa Tatak Arriba. Kasi sunod-sunod ang mga karangalan na dapat natin ipagmayabang bilang mga letranista. The Department of Science and Technology, Science Education Institute, awarded Chris Villoyer of the Elementary and Junior High School Department their Youth Excellence in Science Award. This was to commend him for the numerous awards and medals for the following competition. Ayun naman pala eh. Sunod-sunod talaga mga gantimpalang itinatanggap ng letran. Congratulations, Chris! Sino si Chris? Hindi ka ba nakikinig? Kakasabi ko lang. Bakit hindi ka naka-face mask? And for our final story this episode, last January 31, the 5th Annual Economic and Political Briefing, Arriba Economica e Politica, was held at the SE Auditorium. In partnership with the Manila Times, the event featured outstanding speakers from their respective fields and focused on topics that covered national interests such as politics, the economy, and the nation's plans for building a better future for all Filipinos. The event itself was attended by various school administrators, faculty, staff, students, guests, and media outfits. At dito na nagtatapos ang kwento ko para sa Deus, Patria, at Letran. Pero kung gusto niyo pa akong makita ulit, Nasa admissions office lang ako from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Ay, speaking of which, ang Colegio de San Juan de Letran ay tumatanggap na ng applicants for this school year 2023 to 2024. You can contact us at admissions at letran.edu.ph. Once again, my name is Roland Absede, isang estudyante at ngayon host na ng El Cuento. Arriba, Letran! Ma, nasa TV na ako!